Hi, my name is Manton, and I want to show you our new email subscriptions in micro.blog. It says to let your readers of your blog subscribe and get emails for new blog posts or a collection of new blog posts. So uh, if you click on newsletter on the sidebar, this is for micro.blog premium subscribers, there's an enable email subscriptions button. I'll check that to enable it. And one of the things it does when you first get started is it creates a new page on your blog with a subscription form for people to fill in their email address. I'll quickly go over to that real quick to see what that's like. It's just a normal page on your blog along with other pages you might have. And you can copy this HTML to another page. You can delete this page. You can move it into your blog template. You can do whatever you want. It's just a page on your site, but that, uh, that gets you started. So a couple of the different options for email subscriptions. Uh, by default, it'll send an email for any long blog post that you write with a title, so an essay or a blog post with photos or whatever it is, it'll send an email to subscribers. Uh, another option is micro.blog can collect uh, a lot of short posts or longer blog posts into a weekly email and you can specify what day you want it to be uh, sent on. And so it'll collect those and it'll create a draft email before it sends to subscribers. So you can edit it, review it, look it over, um, even delete it if you change your mind, you don't want it to go out. Uh, and then the third option is similar, collects your blog posts, but into a monthly email. And for this, because you might have a lot of different blog posts, you can specify a specific category. So maybe I only want to send, you know, my photo blog posts out to subscribers. So for just testing here, I'm going to keep it at this simple, send an email for each uh, long blog post I write that has a title. And I will just uh, paste in some text uh, for a new blog post. Let's just call this hello. And I'll click post. So this is posted just to my test blog. And now if I go back over to the newsletter option, I can see it says next newsletter scheduled to send. Um, and I can edit it. I can also show any of the newsletters that have been scheduled. Uh, this one was a test uh, uh, that I had earlier <laughs> when I was testing. I'll just delete that. Um, so this one, uh, the, the title was just hello. Uh, it's scheduled to send. It, it sends it in 30 minutes after it was created. And then I can edit it anytime in that time. You can use Markdown. Of course, if this was a more complicated blog post, I could have HTML and other Markdown and things like that in it. Uh, one thing that's handy is if you want to see what it's going to look like with the header and the footer and everything, you can just send a preview to your email address that's just on file with micro.blog. But I can also edit it. I can change anything, add an introduction. Um, so that's the, the basic feature there. Of course, you see your subscribers at the bottom. I just have one that I'm testing with. Um, if people subscribe, they will get a confirmation email to confirm the subscription. That's the feature. Hope you like it.